Hello everyone, I'm Sandra Lemming and I live in Brisbane, Queensland, Australia. I am also happy to say that I am a proud Forever Living distributor, Forever Living Products distributor. Now what I'd like to do today is I'd like to do just a little quick training video on my FLP Biz site. I use my FLB, FLP Biz site um, so that I have a, an online presence for my, my, my distributor, my, my distributorship. You know, I call my business, my side of the business as a distributor with Forever Living Products, I call it One Stop Allo Shop. So I'm going to show you today how to get into your My FLP Biz. So the first thing you need to do is you need to log in to your Forever Living Products distributor website. Um, now I'm in Australia, of course if you're in another country you'll have another country up there. So you'll pick the country and you'll log in. But I'm in Australia and I'm logged in. So I'm going to go up to My Business in these tabs. And I'm going to scroll down to my FLP biz and I'm going to click on my FLP biz. And this will bring me to this page here, my FLP biz. What I want to do is I want to get into my FLP biz so I can personalize my site a little bit, make it more me. So I'm going to go down to manage my page. Now this brings you into your back dashboard of your My FLP Biz site, which is a product that is offered to all Forever Living Products distributors. Through My FLP, you can pay a monthly fee. Um, it's very reasonable, and you can have four My FLP Biz sites. Now My My FLP Biz, you have templates and a virtual built site and what you can do with it is you can personalize it. And as you can see you've got all these extra um, tools and resources that are added in the back here when you have my, my FLP biz. But I'm just going to change out a banner today. So I'm going to go to my page, I'm going to go down to manage my page, manage. I'm going to click on manage. And here is my business, One Stop Allo Shop. I'm using the template Stay Active. You can choose different templates. You can disable templates. So you might like to, you know, you might be on one of your other templates. But for the Stay Active template, I'm going to show you how to change the top banner. So I'm going to click on Edit Site. And here we are in the back office. And this is the banner that I want to change out. This is the banner I actually like, but I'm going to show you how to change that banner. And then I'll change it back to this one. This is the one that I like. It's got One Stop Allo Shop and it's got Health, Nutrition, Natural Cosmetics. This is what this banner looks like to anyone who visits my site. So any customers, potential customers um, or people just browsing for good quality aloe vera health nutritional products and great cosmetics land on my site this is how it shows to them this is what it looks like this is my banner this is this is my home page okay now it's easy to change out this banner and personalize it you come down to where it says choose you don't want to edit the writing. You, you may want to edit the writing. You may want to delete the writing. Uh, you may want to add some writing. But you, know, you come down to choose and you click on choose just here in the picture frame. Now that will immediately take you into your media library. And if you're like me, you like to have your own personal pictures. So I've got a lot of pictures here that I've uploaded and I use a lot of these pictures on my site at different times. So I can choose any one of, of those personal pictures in, in, in my library 
or I may want to, you know, choose the corporate picture. But let's just say for this intent, you know, this training purposes, it's Christmas time. And I want to give my site a bit of a Christmas feel. Well, I already have a Christmas banner here. So I would click on that picture. And as you can see, the my FLP biz site is doing its thing. And there you go. I have a Merry Christmas to all from One Stop Auto Shop. So there I have my Christmas banner. I, I like that. It's Christmas. You know, it's cheery. So I may run that on the home page. Um, so, you know, at Christmas time, when people land on my site, you know, my site has a bit of a Christmas feel about it. Um, you know, and, and it's as simple as that. I don't have to save it anywhere. That's how my site will look to people. You know, I can leave that banner up there and, you know, this, this is how it will look. You know, people come across my site and that's what I'll see, a nice little Christmas banner up there. Okay. So that's, you know, that's how simple it is to change out your banner, okay? Now, if I want to put it back to the way it was, I can easily go through my library and I can choose a banner to put it back the way it was. If you don't have any personal pictures in your library, it's easy enough to upload. You just click on the upload button. If you have a picture designed, um, say you, you know, went to Fiverr and had a professional banner designed that you want to put on your site, and you've got it saved in a picture file or on your desktop, you would simply click on the upload button. And this upload button will let you choose from a file on your on your computer. So, so you can choose your file and then you'll choose to upload. So I'll go, you know, I go into my picture folders and I can choose, you know, any one of these folders that I have here and choose a picture out of one of those folders as a banner if I like. You know, I, I may like to, to bring this one, you know, this picture here up into my personal folders. I would click opened. And I'll just clear that away there and upload. And so as you can see, what this is doing now is it's uploading the picture that I chose from my picture folder on the computer. So then if I wanted to use that picture, it would be in my library. And I could scroll through my library, find the picture, and there is the picture there. And I could click on that picture. And it will now upload it as the banner on my FLP site. And then there you go. There would be my banner. I could leave that banner there if I was happy with that. I can add some text to it here if I want to. I can change the headline up here simply by clicking on edit. Um, and I, you know, if I'm happy with that banner, I could leave that banner there. Okay, so it's as simple as that. But we'll go back in and I'll choose my banner with one stop Allo shop on it because it matches the banner on my Facebook page that I run. So, and I have my website details on my Facebook fan page. <clears throat> so this was initially my Facebook fan page banner um, that I had done for my Facebook page. And I thought I would upload it onto my site so that when people went from Facebook, my Facebook fan page to my website, my website was congruent. It looked like my Facebook fan page. So they knew that they were in the, in, in the right place. So there you go. That's how you change out the banner on the Stay Active template. So I hope some of, uh, some of you out there will find that helpful. And I look forward to possibly doing some more uh, tutorial videos like this for you all in the near future. Have a great day and I will talk to you again soon. Bye for now.